Oh, you gotta watch this. What we eat? Come on, what we gonna eat? What's wrong with you? I'm good. What we gonna eat? What's wrong with you? Man, I just they just called me. One of my friends called me and told me that my ex passed away. So. Okay, and? It's me, and. Like, right. why, yeah. then why are you sitting here sad? Because of that. Girl, she died 15 minutes ago. So you had 15 minutes to do all the same then before I got here. I think you just go with the girl. You can still go with her. You can go with her now. I ain't gonna sit here and look at you sad because somebody you used to go with. You can go with her right now. Who got the body? Just lost a good friend of mine. Don't even care. I sure don't. Like I'm finna sit here and look at you sad because you just lost a good friend. I hope you lost your guy appetite too. But I'm finna go get you something to eat. Shit. Well, I mean, how do you feel about that? Did she over exaggerate? Even though this is an ex, it was a person that was in his life. I mean, he's human, he does have emotions. He's not boohoo crying. And he's probably just in a state of shock. Like, wow, this is a person that was once in my life. Could she have reacted a little better? Yes, I believe she definitely could have reacted a little better. Instead of saying, I'm sorry for your loss, she goes, well, you had 15 minutes to get over that. Wow. It's an ex. And the person is no longer around. Should they give that person a moment to like reflect? Is it wrong? I mean, I'm just asking questions. We have to understand that people have emotions and we cannot control people. We don't own people. You don't possess anyone. Only person you can control is you. Now, this guy lost someone that was in his life. We don't know the whole ordeal. We don't know why they broke up, but he's having a moment of, ah, man, this person that was in my life is now gone. She did ask him what was wrong and he and he felt comfortable enough to tell her he could have been like nah i'm good he trusted her in that moment and what did she do she turned around and said you had 15 minutes to get over it let me read some of these comments right quick she worried about you having feelings for a person that's no longer here that's the highest level of insecurity that has been reached another person stated they actually comforted their husband when he found out that his ex OD'd stated what kind of wife would I be if I didn't make him feel like he could be vulnerable with me the lady in the video did the total opposite now she's probably going to wonder why her man doesn't come to her when he needs to be vulnerable because at that very moment instead of speaking life into him and pouring into him and consoling him she said, you had 15 minutes to get over it. Was she right? Was she wrong? What would you do? Drop your comments. I want to hear what you got to say. Don't forget to hit that like, share, subscribe, follow. You know what to do. Let's go. I want your life. I want my motor. I want to build house. I still want your number. Give me that. What's it called? G-Wagon. Oh, depends.